getting my hands dirty. This is something, so you will see me out there. I'm not gonna be one of the ones that do a drive by in a nice time, like, well, bless you. Y'all, y'all doing real good. That won't be me. I'm coming dressed to work, okay? And I'm not above it. And it's not because I'm trying to make sure you guys see me as something. This is something that God has placed on my heart as a Christian to do. This is what I like doing. So before this even happened, I was doing stuff like this. So I'm really excited. I want everybody, remember I told you this is not a ministry thing. This is a church-wide thing. I want everyone to participate. And I understand we have jobs and other obligations. So I say, if you can give 15 minutes, if you can give a half hour, if you can give the whole day, I ask that you come out. Any contribution that you make towards this is valuable. Okay, so I want everybody to be a part of this. Maybe you can't clean, but maybe you can hand out water to those who need it. Maybe you can be one of those people that while we're cleaning, you can talk to neighborhood people about Jesus. See, it's more than just clean up. All right, and everybody can do something. If you are able-bodied, everybody can do something. And I want us as a ministry, as a church, to go out and do this together. It's something in unity that we can do together that shows everyone what we're really about and what our heart is, okay, what our heart posture is. So that's that. If you are interested, and I don't care if you are or not, come. <laughs> so if you're there, let me know, because... I'm your pastor or no? Wow. Saying, I, I know I'm easy going. I'm like, let me come if you feel like it. I'm done with that. I just told Juan, I'm done with that. God been dealing with me about the level of honor and excellence here at EOC. It's a new day. Say that, I'm pastor. Some stuff that I used to settle for, I refuse. Come on now. Okay? We got to step it up because it's showing honor to God, not me. And so we're going to do this as unto the Lord. And we know full well that Jesus is sitting here. Everybody be acting a whole different way. Come on, help us. So we need to do that on a daily basis. Help us. Because it's in our faith because it's with us all the time. Help we need us. To those people. Yeah. So with that being said, God has given us the vision to go and contribute and outreach towards the city. Don't just take it like I may or may not do it. Are you going to do what God say or not? Come on. Not what I say. You going to do what God say or not? Go out your way to please God. Don't go out your way to please me. I don't, I'm not going to know who all out there. Either you're going to go out your way to please God or not. Then you want him to help you with your bills or he'll leave for cancer, but you can't go out your way to please him. I'm just saying, and he ain't even that type of God. That's the crazy part about it. He don't even need you to do something to get something. His grace and mercy is great, but it's the least we can do. We've been learning. Go out into the world. Go out into the world. Now you got an opportunity to go out and be like, oh, I'm going on vacation. And you knew about this last year. Nobody can say I was last minute. We had a calendar last year. Early. See how quiet it got? On purpose. I know what I'm doing. No, I don't fuss all the time, but I'm very serious now. We're going we to have to step it up as a ministry. And so I'm telling you now, going forward, you might see a different me. It's not personal. It's all right, it's Pastor. It's all right, Pastor. Come on. I ain't going to emulate what God wants us to do, and I want you to follow suit. Okay? Come on. All right. If you're able to do the whole day, meet us here Friday at 10. We'll probably meet in the gym. Okay, so come to the back, don't park in the front, park in the back. We're gonna meet in the gym at 10 a.m. so that everybody has their marching orders and then we're gonna go. If you are not able to make it at 10, let's say you, you're gonna come while we're already out there, I ask that you speak with Minister Cynthia and say, hey, where will you be so that you can meet us where we'll be? You understand what I'm saying? And then that way you won't be looking for us all over the city, you'll know exactly where we're gonna be, okay? That's Friday and Saturday. Sunday, we come here first for church. It will be a one hour service because our picnic starts at one. Okay, so we're gonna meet here, we're gonna worship the Lord, we're gonna get some good quick word, and then we're gonna go to Tolleston Park and we're going to minister to those people, okay? We, uh, uh, we had a discussion about what we should wear and colors and all of that, that was wild. But, and we were like, we're gonna wear EOC t-shirts. Well. 
there's not enough EOC t-shirts for everybody to wear an EOC t-shirt. So what I'm asking you to wear is either a gray shirt or a purple or burgundy type shirt so that we can show unity. If you don't have either of those, it does not mean that you cannot come. <laughs> That's silly. <laughs> like, I don't got the shirt, so I ain't gonna be there. Because I'm not gonna look like, no, you can still take part, wear some clothes, okay? Please. <laughs> and, and dress for what we're doing, okay? So if you're clean, be careful. Uh, we want you to wear proper shoes, hard sole shoes. Uh, gym shoes are cool, but if there's an errant piece of glass or a nail that can puncture the shoes that you have, that's going to be something that I'm concerned about. So I ask that you wear the proper shoes. Uh, gloves, if you feel like that's a thing for you as well. I probably have some gloves myself. The proper pants. It's going to be hot outside, so if you can bring a cooler of water for yourself, uh, something frozen or something so that you can sip on it. We're going to try to provide water, I think, as well. But make sure that you bring you some as well. And I know I'm spending time talking about it, but we're here, okay? And, and all y'all don't come on Wednesday night, so I gotta take advantage when all y'all here. <laughs> no shade, no shade. Uh, <laughs> those of you online, if you would like to join us, you are welcome to join us. I'm not gonna say, well, we don't see you in the building, but we can see you here, that's not gonna happen. So if you would like to join us, please join us as we go out and minister to the community. Uh, let's praise God for what we're doing this week. Amen. All right, I'm good talking about.